Hey guys, we got some bad news today. Um, Carl is sick, so he's not here right now, and that sadly means we don't have Carl's question. But we can we still have a special guest coming on today, and it's Herbert from Mahoy Manoy Season 3. Hello, everybody. Hello. <clears throat> so, we don't have a game today, sadly, but we, we will just ask you a bunch of questions. Just, just have some fun today, all right? Okay. So, okay. today, the first question I have for you is what was it like having this new character in the thing that comes up in Season 2, Episode 1, but then gets killed, but comes back as a and bad then, guy? Um, so how was that? How was that change for you? It was fun watching the character, how he just changed and his character development. Yeah. Um, it re was really sad. Um, during his death scene. Yeah, yeah. It was. Uh, I would argue it's one of the saddest deaths in Mahimanoi. Yeah. I would argue his um last um, death. Yeah, it was very sad. I was very sad. And and I what I loved about after you died, it's a sad moment. But from that, we did get to slap Susan's Goobler. Everybody clap that up. Everybody clap that up. Let's go, let's go. Anyways. Yeah, thanks, thanks. Yeah. That, that scene was, like, one of my favorites, just because we got to tell her to don't do that, blah, blah, blah. He, he was our friend. Then, we, I, then I got to beat her with this. It was, it was just so fun. Yeah, it was, it was really fun. Yeah. Um, sadly, you weren't there to do it, but I think after the take, you did, everybody pounded on her a little bit after that, yeah. Yeah. It was pretty fun. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, so, how do you feel as Herbert? How do you, how do you feel with the same character? What do you have similarities with, do you, if you have any? With, I mean, being Herbert and, um, pr probably, like... The drip, to be honest, like. Yeah, it's pretty drippy. Shine. So far, every one of these, everyone, all the characters who were evil, eventually, all have the spatula. I wonder, sure. do you, un, do you, because you're the third monkey who was mm -hmm. evil, do you um, know why yeah. this is? It's kind of like every villain um, needs, like, a weapon. Yeah. And the reason we get the spatula is, it took it was it was Tickle Tipson's. Uh, I'll tell you behind the scenes stuff that nobody really knows. It was Tickle Tipson's. He got it from his mother. Then when he died, when he fell off the bridge, he dropped it. Nobody picked it up. Then, and Saint Dan walked across, found it, took it, became evil. Then when I um, when he died, you left the spatula, and I was still there, and so I picked up the spatula, took it, and, well, that that's how it happens, and with the, all the other villains that you will learn, they will tell the same exact story just from when they got it. That's cool. So, with, with Herbert, what is your favorite thing about his character? About his character, probably the, like I said, the character development is really interesting. How he used to be good and then bad, and his last moments, he just wanted to be in peace with all of his troubles in life. Yeah, that's understandable. That's my favorite. Um, so when you read this script of when he was, when, what was your reaction when you read this script and you realized you were Tickle Tipson's oh. brother? Yeah, that was, like, surprising to me. Like, we never really talked about it, but, like, Tickle Tipson, like, that's, he, like, he, he's just pure evil. And I did, I, I, we were polar opposites when we first came in. He yeah. was evil, I was a good guy. And then, when he, like, it's weird being his brother, honestly. But I had to yeah. say it, it's weird being his brother, like, killed my parents. Like, what am I gonna do about that? Yeah, yeah. Um, so, with every everybody else, you know, you have Tickle Tips and you have Insane Dan, all those. What was it like when you realized that you had to 
you had to die, but you also had to. You died twice, technically, in the thing, right? Yeah, technically, I did die twice. Um, I think you're like died. one of the only characters to do that. Technically, technically, die twice. Yeah, technically, yeah, I'm like one of the only characters to have multiple deaths in Mahoy Manoy. So that's really cool, and that's the special thing about um, him. Yeah. And how he kind of, well, his, his death rebirthed him into yeah. a new and eviler version of himself. And I and see right revenge. now, you're wearing his old badge, the Sunflower badge. And Yeah, I just felt, um... And if you go back in the original episodes, you can see his wardrobe changes quite a bit. Originally, he didn't even have the sunglasses, didn't have the spatula, no. and he only had the hat and the sunflower. But then later on, yeah. he gained the sunglasses. Sunglasses. And, and then when I became evil, I got the, the bow tie yeah. and spatula. Spatula, yeah. So, do you like all those changes, or did you feel like it... Ruined it. I, I liked bit. having the flower to represent how I was good, and then like, yeah, I died and was rebirthed and gotten like a spiffy new look. That's and I got the spatula, so I am pretty happy with the changes. Yeah. Um, but I do miss old Herbert. A That's bit, understandable. But yeah. It's fine. I'm okay with the changes. Bottom yeah. line. Cool. Um, I think that's all the questions today. Um, just say hey to everybody and say goodbye. Right. Oh, hi everybody and subscribe to Mohoi Manoi. Yeah. Watch the movie coming soon. Yeah, it's I'm coming not in soon. It, but yeah. Uh, uh, I wish I was in it. Dang. Alright, well that's Herbert everybody. You thank you for coming on. Alright, bye Herbert. <laughs> that was Herbert everybody. Hey, you. Subscribe right now. It's free. Do it now. Or else I'm gonna sell your childhood teddy bear. And if you don't have one, I'll sick Carl on you. You don't want that. Do it.